Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Mega Will Plays Monster Train. Very excited. Last run, we did a little Spiky Boy build. Um, so after our Spike Lee build kind of failed, we uh, we haven't played since. So I'm very excited. I think we uh, maybe had unlocked something uh, last time, but I'm not sure. Let's make sure all of our audio is looking good. I think it's looking solid. Always, it never, it's never the, the best thing to do because like, or it's never the best thing to not check your audio. Double negative, triple negative. <sighs> Uh, it is a good thing to check your audio, basically, because, like, you can record, like, a whole episode of stuff and have nothing happen. Um, so, yeah, that, that seems a little crazy. So, yeah, we have a new clan here, the Stygian Guard, um, which is great. And then we can ally them with, you know, whoever we want. So, so far, we've got, I guess we can't really ally with ourselves. That doesn't make much sense, right? And we have this new covenant here, too. I'm just going to hit random. So, that means we can just kind of, we get what we get, you know? It's up to the cosmos what happens to us. And therefore, you can then blame the cosmos when things go horribly, horribly wrong. If you're stepping into the chat for the first time, my name is Mecha Will. Hello. Good to see you. Um, I did not fill up my canteen with enough water today, so I will be taking a small break to get more water later on. I know it's the worst thing that you could possibly think of. It looks like we've gotten um, the Stygian Guard and... Dude, I don't even know. I don't even know what our uh, assisting unit is. This fortify must be from the Hellhorn, so I guess we'll, we'll figure that out. And then our final boss, this is important. The first spell card played each turn gets consumed. So, eh. We either got to stack up on a lot of spells, or we ha we gotta, we're going to have to uh, have a way to get things out of consume, um, or just focus on more of like a uh, just a tanky, tanky kind of deal. I like this Frostbite thing, though. Frostbite, unit takes a damage per stack at the end of the turn. I think it's very similar to the poison from Slay the Spire. So, all right, let's, uh, let's get into it. First, let's pick our champion. And let's check out the champion options. We have a Conduit or the Totem. Old Tethys, my dude. Old Teton Titan's Bane. Dude, that's what the kids called him back in high school. This one says damage spells cast on this floor cost less. So, that's just great for casting. But this guy's got Sweep, which is phenomenal. It basically takes out, you know, everybody in one hit. Um, and then Spell Weakness as well. So I'm actually... Uh, the stats don't look as good, but it's not always about, you know, what you're packing in the stat department. Sometimes it's about the motion of the ocean. Herzl's Horde. We can either get the randomized Sneko Eye thing, which they seem to be giving us a lot lately, maybe because we did so well with it, or we can apply Dazed to enemies when they enter the Pyro Room. This is dangerous, so we're just going to take the Dazed. I don't think it's going to make a huge difference, but I guess we'll find out. The first defense. We know these guys. Uh, I always kind of like taking the Trial at the start, just because Pyro Damage... It's not a big deal to us, um, because we'll probably have a chance to heal it as we go along. Y'all know how that goes. And I'm excited, okay? Right? They got the Warmongers playing. Just an absolute slapper. And, uh, yeah, and we have this new challenge, but we'll get some gold out of it, which will help us upgrade. Which I think will be very, very useful for the boss. We got four damage coming out here. Never mind, we got zero damage coming out, so I'm gonna go ahead and put down my... My boy. You're my boy, Blue. Uh, this looks like this applies to the whole floor, which is awesome. Um, it would be nice to have it for the boss, but honestly, I kind of like just taking out, like, you know, 20 of these guys. We have uh, room to play everything, so we're just going to murder that fool. Um, and I feel like if I put this guy here, he's going to die, right? Actually, if I put him anywhere, he's going to die. Except for down here. Why don't, you, why don't you do some good? You do some freaking good in this world, okay? And they're dazed? Look, it's not even a problem. It's not even a problem. So, yeah, this was the right move. Um, we have some armor. Uh, I'm actually going to apply that to my boy Blue over here. Uh, just because. And let's start getting stacked up on this floor. That seems fair. Take out the archer. Six damage to the enemy unit. 
And uh, these guys are just... Oh, we forgot about that. We should have gotten the gold. Bye. Honestly, it's a big mistake. Here. Ghost Braden back in the house. First of all, welcome. It's good to see a friendly face in the absolute community chat here. Uh, explain this game, please. No problemo. This is, uh, so this is a, a card game, obviously, strategy card game, and, uh, this is your hand down here. Um, you basically, I mean, it's like most card games, you've got spells, uh, like these things, and you've got units that you can kind of summon, like Yu-Gi-Oh style. I don't know, my references are old. Don't talk about that. Um, on the right side is where all the enemies are coming out of, uh, and they all come out of the bottom here, generally, and then they start sort of ascending your train. Um, if they make it all the way to the top, they're gonna attack your heart. The heart of the dragon or something, you know, last shard of the pyre, yeah, something similar to that. Uh, as written by the Aragon guy. And then, uh, yeah, you can basically defend, and it's like a, uh, yeah, it's like you're, you're, you're killing stuff. I don't know, you'll figure it out. If you have more questions, let me know. Uh, for example, these guys are not looking too, uh, not looking too hot. Uh, 19 health, 5 health. Let's just, like, we just, like, destroy this guy. No, he had a lot of armor on. Whoops. That was a mistake. It's okay. Now he's dead. Let's do ourselves a favor here. So we summon this unit. They'll attack each other, and, you know, we're both going to be fine. This guy is dead to the spell I cast. And these guys are just chilling down there, because you know what? Everybody deserves a break every now and then. You know what I'm saying? All right. If your head hasn't exploded yet from absolute discussion, we now have a boss fight. And a boss fight works by attacking basically back and forth between our side and their side until somebody dies. Um, so you basically get one turn to set up and then you just watch the battle play out. Uh, so we're going to do that. Um, I think we put some armor on our boy. You can see here he's going to be taking about 40 damage, but this is going to help out quite a bit. We're gonna double down on that. We're gonna kill this guy. Uh, the X means that we've killed him, so watch the killing happen. You ready? Amazing. The graphics. The 2020 experience, dude. You never expect the Spanish Inquisition. I do have it, like, sped up right now, so it might be hard to follow, which I understand. Um, we've won the battle, and so we get to the victor go the spoils. Get some nice gold. We get to pick more cards, so you build your deck as you go along. Uh, so far, we've got a pretty sweet deck. We've got the uh, the spell damage and this frostbite stuff. Ooh, but this is really good too. Um, in spell weakness, we have that already. Uh, in fact, it'd be nice to have like a high damage spell, so I'm gonna go with the crystals there. Uh, we got more armor, rage, or uh, AOE. We kind of have AOE. I don't mind. I don't mind a little, a little minion to help us out. You know, they basically have overrun the Universal theme park. So why shouldn't we have one? You know what I'm saying? All right. We get to pick a path. By the way, if you've ever played a game called Slay the Spire, this is a lot more clear. But yeah, uh, we're gonna pick a path here. We either want to upgrade units or upgrade spells. That's tough. I'm actually gonna upgrade. Uh, Upgrade some spells. Check it out. Permafrost, magic consume, or spells cost less. Uh, we got a lot of gold to mess around with. So, let's see. I don't really care about permafrost. I'm, I'm going to tell you what. Right away. No, that's dumb. <laughs> Sorry. Right away, we're going to make these crystals nice and, and, and easy to cast. Baby, I love it. Also, Brayden, if you you know if you're not into this game, I that's that's cool. You you might actually be into the game too. I'm just kind of guessing. But uh, we're we're gonna be doing this for an hour, and then we'll switch on to uh, uh, Sekiro, and then we'll switch on to Bloodborne. So we're doing like a triple triple Decker sandwich here today. Uh, Purge. <laughs> we're gonna be getting a new unit, so I'm gonna take this out of my deck so that it doesn't suck the life out of me. Um. Let's re-roll. Okay, that was a horrible re-roll. We can make this free, but honestly, that seems like kind of a waste. I guess. 
I guess we'll make that. Amazing. Okay, we've done ourselves a great service. It looks lit. Hell yeah, it looks lit, my man. This is a, uh, this game came out, like, a couple days ago. So it's, like, it's fresh. There's some brand new stuff happening right here. Uh, okay, so... <laughs> if you've seen the first time I played this game, we just destroyed it with this demon fiend here. Because this guy is an actual monster, you know. And I mean that in all sincerity. Uh, so, I mean, I don't know. If it works once, it'll work twice. Let's go fight some, uh, some bad guys. All right, here's our next enemies, okay? We got the the white hat hacker, we got the black hat hacker, uh, and we got the, the guy that needs hacked. So it's the, uh, the the priest, who's like, I guess, a spellcaster. This dude, who gets extra damage when we cast spells. So that's not good, but we should, we should be able to kill him. And then this guy who's got sweep, which also sucks. Spikes suck. We lost a, a fight to spikes before, so we're just gonna wash our hands of the of the madness basically uh, and try and take out this guy as quickly as we can um, I also realize of course we don't have the energy for this but don't worry about it okay we, we got it all planned out you just got to trust in old mecha will we're gonna do this he gets some extra damage that's okay though we're gonna deal with it we're gonna let this uh, this guy sort of tank the hit from him so it doesn't get to our our champion in the back that sounds like a fantastic play. I'm not going to play this because uh, he's going to get even more damage. Do I care about that really, though? I mean, I do what I want, Mom. You can't tell me what to do. All right, so we got a little gold boy. Some extra armor, which you got to love. And another relatively annoying dude. Let's get some armor up. Ah. I don't like you, okay? I don't like you. Um. But if this guy's gonna die anyway, like, what are you gonna do to me that hasn't already been done? So, uh, basically... Suck it, bro. Hello. We still didn't do anything about this. That's our bad. We're wasting... We're, we're leaving money on the table, boys. But you know what? That's what rich people do. And, you, and if you listen to Warren Buffett, that's what he says. You know, you gotta live the lifestyle. I don't think Warren Buffett says that, but he's a rich guy that works as a great straw man here. Uh, and they're gonna get, they're gonna get toasted by that pyre. This guy's dying already, so why are we worried about that? And then goodbye. I've now taken your life to zero. It's that simple. When I summon this guy, let's get some extra armor. Feeling spicy. Now I'm stacked up. And uh, you can't stop me. Can't stop. Will not stop. The name of my autobiography. Alright, so now we're on the boss. He's killing us, like, with extreme prejudice here. Which is quite annoying. But I tell you what. Do a little bit of that frostbite. Nobody likes talking about. Get rid of these guys. See if we can no move the needle at all. No. Get some more frostbite in here. My 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 dude does not stand a chance. Take it away, boys. These I mean these these guys will die, and you know we'll we'll go to their funeral. We'll we'll feel bad for them later, later, you know. Whoa, Minty Pup back in the chat. Glad to see you. Good to have absolute bodies in the chat. Hello. Guess what, Teddy Bear. I mean, you, you've given away your whole plot. I guess bear. Bear down for midterms, my friend. Um, or probably some more relevant information to you, but you know, you never know. Goodbye. This guy is toasted. See you later. Oh, Minty Puff, you got affiliated. That's fantastic. That's some fresh news. That's some, that's some news for the ages. I will also... Teddy Bear. Somehow. It's not as cute. I'm not fluffy. Um, but that's great. Uh, take me with you. The chain of progression, please. Drag me with you. I am very celebratory here. I would, I would, uh, play some jams if I had them. 
I mean, I, I could probably find some, but you know, the the best jam right now is destroying these monsters. Uh, so what does that, I mean, what does that mean for you? What do you, uh, and that means I think you got to a certain, you know, follower amount, which is great. And you unlock some, some features, um, and content, right? Which is awesome. You'll drag me along with you? You'll drag me through the trenches? That's the kindest thing anybody's ever said to me. Um, let's pick a card before this gets, uh, <laughs> way too long for the guys on YouTube. What do we have? The Crypt Builder. Deal 60 damage and push a bag. That's pretty disgusting. Uh, Titan's Tooth. They keep trying to pawn off on us. And then this thing is real cheap, too. Tell you what, we're going to run out of, like, energy real quick. I don't even know, dude. I guess let's get the cheap one because we don't have the energy for it. Some piercing stuff. I guess we're going all in on spells. Let's not even, you know, not even worry about it. You think the last boss is going to stop us? It's, he's a joke, okay? He's a joke. I was going to look to try and find his name so I could give him a joke nickname, but I can't find it, so I fell flat on that. And you know what? Let's let's do it, boys. Let's upgrade our spells even more. Every time I've been here, I've had some good laughs. That's good. I want good laughs. It's the bad laughs that, uh, that really bring down the spirits here. Now, that was a stupid joke. Don't worry about that one. Uh, and I think you deserve to get affiliate. Well, that's that's very kind of you. I, you know, one day, I guess, if I drink enough universe juice, it'll, uh, it'll be there for me. Or something. Um, <laughs> these suck. So please, get me better upgrades. Can't believe you've done this to me. They really want this consume thing to happen. Um... Uh, that's like a big damage dealer. I don't mind doing this uh, this piercing damage consume. <laughs> you know. It just helps kind of clear up the deck a little bit so we can get to the frostbite stuff a little easier. But we're not getting good draws here. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. There's some sort of irony in the, uh, you know, Minty Pup's gravy train happening right now. And me playing a literal train game. Which doesn't happen often. I mean, they, you can count on the on your on one hand, probably one finger, the amount of games that you have uh, that have uh, trains as the main appetizer. You'll put me in your panels. So nice of you. Very, it's very kind of you. I'll put you in my panels. Hey, what do you know? I can tell everybody I, I'm friends with the uh, uh, with the affiliate. It's really gonna impress them. Uh, we can copy. We can copy a card. Do we want to copy something? Who wants to get nut uh, to get nuts here? You want to do this demon fiend? That's silly. You know, we could copy this uh, this piercing damage here. That seems pretty dope. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna do it five times because you can't stop me, mom. I'm gonna do what I want, and you can't tell me what to do. Where is it? Okay. Just like a just like a real you know whiny uh, teenager. <laughs> you can't stop me, mom. Wait a second, can you help me find this real quick before I storm out? Okay, you sweetheart. Be terrified if that was your actual mother. That voice was was not okay. Uh new unit? Who wants the, the yoked Sylvester Stallone type here? Huh? He does rage? He's a heavy hitter? This guy gains armor? Honestly, the armor will probably help out a little better, you gotta assume, right? Resolve. Triggers after combat. This guy's just gonna get nasty here. I'm trying to see what other what other stuff we have. I mean our our units kinda suck. But I tell you what, let's go for this uh let's go for this tank. I always like the tanks, they help you, you know, play the game correctly. It's a very important thing. I'm excited to, to, to be streaming this week. It's a fun week for me. And it was a long freaking weekend. We don't even need to discuss. So, guess who's back back again? Willie's back? Don't ever call me Willie. There's a, there's a huge problem with that. Alright, what do we got? We got our big boss fight. Okay, you don't scare me, my friends. Your name is The Professor. You're here to, you're here to, to like, you know, tell me to buy textbooks. 
It was a very different thing than normal, okay? I tell you what, we don't... We don't mind taking care of him this way, because uh, we got all sorts of... Uh, extra shots in the chamber, as they say, you know? What the heck is this? Spell weakness. We love spell weakness. This murders him. Honestly, that's pretty dope, too. Why don't we just do that? And, uh, let's save our boy. Whoa! That's a tough one. If you guys don't know what's happening right now, don't worry. It's like, I don't know. The cards, they fly around the screen. Like I'm David Blaine. And I just let it happen. You just let it happen. It's horrible, depending on the context here, but, uh, you know, it's a card game, so what are you, what are you gonna do to me, you know? Uh, six damage to this guy. This guy is feeling all right, getting good grades. His future is so bright, now he's dead. That's how the lyrics go. Uh, 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 other such noises of approval. That worked out well. I mean, we're not paying attention to this guy, but... He does. Honestly, our pyre, like, we can just send, we can send them straight up the elevator, you know what I'm saying? This is that Disney ride that keeps breaking. It's the Tower of Terror. And when they get to the top, my friends, they are gonna drop down. Um, cool. But we do, I mean, we do have to win this game in the next 30 minutes, so maybe we should start playing faster. Uh, let's do, uh, they don't tell you about the, they don't tell you about that right there. I'll tell you what, they definitely don't tell you about. Uh, give me a sec here. We don't want to discard anything, so we have to play this last. We're gonna do ourselves a favor there. There you go. Look at this. The dream team, dude. The unlikely breakfast club of individuals. You have guy who wears helmet all the time. You've got, you know, I don't know, aggressive uh, fairy. And then, you know, you've got like Earl over here. Earl's a nice guy. In the breakfast club, you always have to have one nice guy. Really helps balance the rest of the painful, emotional humor. Alright. We took a little damage, but you know what? Who's even worried about it? This is what we call housekeeping. I'm just I'm just cleaning up after a day's work. Uh soon. I tell you what, let's get some frostbite on the boss. It's not gonna do anything. Silly. Um, that guy's gonna, what, 15 damage? Yeah, I mean, it could be a problem. So you know what, let's, uh, let's get 10 damage out there. So that he goes down to 19. And then we have to do this. Oh no, I've made a, I've made a terrible mistake. No, never mind, okay, so yeah. So he won't do any damage to the pyre. These guys are doing fine. The world is as it should be. If you're joining, I gotta say thank you. I do appreciate it. We're doing ourselves a triple decker live show today. Three games in the very short span of three hours. So an hour each game. We're about halfway into our monster train section. If you haven't checked this game out, do because it's dope. And also, uh, I have episodes coming up on YouTube. Actually, there's a few already out. So if you want to check the YouTube out for more, then feel free. Now this guy, what is he? What is he joking? He's gonna kill my whole crew, is that what you're telling me? He's never heard of this though, has he? He's never heard of Mr. Frostbite. It's a uh, winter uh, wonderland uh, shtick. 118 is less than I than I hoped for complete annihilation, but you know what? It's, it's never the end. It's only the end. I got. I gotta ask Mickey Puff. Who, who's who's supplying you with the bears? Okay, there's a there's a, a black market trade of bear emotes happening on Twitch, and I I have to find the source. I need to get to the bottom of it. Um. Yeah. Maybe one day we can actually play that. Doesn't that sound fun? Oh, this guy is like done. Goodbye. I killed you with the freaking torch spell, dude. How does it feel to get singed by making the, you know, pasta on the stovetop, huh? 
The bears from local space bear. Okay, well, that makes sense. Thank you for that. Now I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna have to go arrest him for, uh, you know, illegal uh, bear stock market trading, insider trading. He's, uh, he's fluffing the market up with fluff. And he needs to be stopped. He or she. I, I always assume that's a bad idea. Uh, <clears throat> Poor Frost effigy. It's the last time you'll hear me say that word. Transfer all frostbite on this floor to a unit and then double the amount of frostbite. That's pretty sweet. Apply sap and frostbite. Sap's pretty good. Rage and armor, sap and frostbite. Honestly, so I'm considering... I know this looks great, but I, I'm doing these consume spells because the final boss is going to consume our spells anyway. We might as well pick spells that already have it, you know? What the ever-loving... The consumer of crowns. This is, this, is, this is the big daddy. This is too big daddy for us. We can't take that. What are you talking about? 10 energy? Are you outside of your mind? Are you living in an apartment complex away from your cerebellum? Uh, the icy silophyte applies spell weakness to the attack unit. I don't know what I'm talking about. Just forget about it. The cold chalia? Frostbite. I see the magic words. I click the card. It's that simple. Now, we could get this, but honestly, we have a real energy problem. So I'm going to take the extra energy. Fully upgraded. Um, my name is Inigo Montoya, so watch out. Uh, we get an artifact and some coins. Or duplicate. Yeah, this looks good. I like this side, okay? Sue me. Let's duplicate first. We could have two demon fiends, which would just destroy, uh, if we could ever play them. <laughs> which I guess we can now. It's like one a turn, though. Uh, we could duplicate our helix spell. Let's let's do it. We could we kind of have horrible uh, units there. I hate to just rely on the demon fiend, but golly, like if you're gonna make who who says golly anymore? Let's stop. Let's put that nonsense away. If you're gonna put a card like that in the game, I'm gonna I'm gonna take it. Um, just get completely buffed and yoked on spellcast or get real mad this is like <laughs> you ever see mystery men this is like mr furious he's so mad and that's his superpower okay. now that we've done all of this look at our look at our deck it's beautiful uh we're gonna just take out the trash sorry to say you know don't mean to be rude but those guys knew, you know, in grade school that they were, uh, they were not cut out for this world. We have the conduit and the handheld totem. So we can get totem number level two, still sweeps. This time more spell weakness, which we love. Or we can now do the, uh, cost reduction card. I don't know, the spell weakness is pretty good, but honestly, let's double up. We're gonna start stacking things like a, like an onion with layers. I'm glad Shrek has has brought all of that parlance into you know normal everyday speaking speaking life. We have this armor guy. We can give them extra armor for more coins. Do I care about you at all? I mean, honestly, we've got a bunch of piercing spells, so let's do it, brother. I'm not afraid. This is like I'm riding a horse into battle. <sighs> slaps that's a good one i like that trick i hope you guys got your headphones in these guys got their hands up already they were never prepared now what do they do they get more damage this is silly but we should probably just we should probably just do that right whoa minty pup thank you for the host very appreciated we're out here boys uh doing good very appreciated i love it Thank you. Very true to your word. Also, I don't know what happened down here. The spell cost has uh, suddenly gone to a respectable level. So let's just do ourselves a little favor here. Send these guys back to the Shadow Realm from whence they came. That sound good to you? Look at this beefcake down here, dude. 
This guy's gonna make it in like a, a Hollywood top 10 list, you know? Top 10, like top male model, top 10 demon of the year, something like that, you know? You never know about about the categories. They change every year. Um, let's just ice this fool. Um, Cold Chalia, I'm loving it. So let's let's get you out of here so we can start getting you pumped up. And honestly, this guy also. Because this guy will start to get real buffed. And then... Uh, yeah. Look at that. The buffing is happening. Wax on, wax off. And now we've got this extra one. You gotta be, you gotta be kidding me. I am a god. Praise be to Mecha Will. Um, okay. Don't ever talk about yourself in the third person ever again. Uh, you can leave that to other people. We're gonna put some armor on our just absolute unit here. Sounds fantastic to me. Although we should probably start, yeah, we should probably start casting on this floor, right? Just to get the, the juice out there. There you go. That's just for the extra, because why not, you know? Uh, these guys will die. Don't worry about it. But I'm gonna do ourselves a little favor. Steel worker. This is old Iron Joe. Don't mess with Iron Joe, dude. I now suddenly realize that this has gotten political and I didn't mean to go there. Joe is just a common name. This guy will headbutt the competition. This guy's taking 60 damage. Wouldn't want to be your friend. Oh, we can just get another one out there. Nah, we can't. We can't let this happen. How dare they do this to us. Goodbye. Goodbye. That was spell weakness. They don't tell you about that in school, do they? They don't teach that subject in school, do they? Probably should have just done it for the trigger, but you know what? We're learning. I can I can see looking at this game and being like, what the heck is happening? Why is this strange set of creatures fighting people on a four-floor train? Very common way to set up your uh, your locomotive. In case you didn't know. Uh, and this is just perfect. Let's just, uh... Let's ice this fool. Let's, uh... Ice this fool. I was thinking maybe we just ice that fool. And this is becoming, like, the killing zone. So, you know, watch out. You're gonna have this guy. He's gonna... He's the Mater D, dude. He's gonna collect your order. And then you're gonna come up here. You're gonna have your main entree, dude. Don't even talk to me about the tiramisu up on top, dude. The dessert's really gonna get you incredibly decadent. I love a good tiramisu while we're on the subject. Anyway, let's uh, let's get this taken care of. This is our boss fight, yeah? So he is gonna kill um, our boy, Blue, but we'll, uh, we'll do him one better. Let's get some frostbite up in here. Some frostbite. By the way, brother, did you ever hear about these spells? That I'm casting. And, uh, you know, all is as it should be. This guy stands no chance. Let it play out. I do feel like a god. I'm playing with, with these people's lives. Watching the scenarios play out. The power is getting to my head a little bit. Got another problem here. But honestly, I don't think it's a problem unless you make it a problem. See, the thing is, you're going to have a real hard time getting through the Dream Team. That's all I got to say. Believe it or not, this is on ultra speed. Or maybe I've just had so much Red Bull that my perception of time has slowed down. That's, that's possible. It happens. This guy's hands are up. I'm sorry, my man. I'm taking you to the... Uh... I'm taking you to the Shadow Realm. I almost punched my tripod. Yeah! We won. And the spoils of war are ours. Our pyre looking hot and healthy. We gotta speed up the game, though, so we don't cut into the Sekiro segment. Honestly, I don't think people would mind. Not a lot of people watch that segment. Uh, <laughs> so let's just do what we do. We have Dazed. We got this nice consume. I'm telling I'm going all in on the consume just because of the, the final boss. We're we're prepping for the final boss. Move a unit to the front, apply armor. 
Return a random consumed spell in your hand. Yes. It's consumed build for days, boys. Which path shall we take? There's so many options. Option A or option B. There's never been more options than that. We can either make our deck a little better. Or we can make our spells a little better. Uh, that's a rough one, my friend. Oh wait, these are trinkets. Let's let's go the trinket route. We haven't seen too many of those, just because we're just because we're here. Hell's Banners, dude, is Motley Crue's next album after they decide to get back together. Units gain an, up, an extra upgrade slot. It's a little late in the game, to be fair. When a card with Consume is played, restore some Pyre health. That's eh, it's synergy, but also it sucks. And <laughs> when you summon a second unit during a turn, gain three energy. That is what I like to hear. Um, I'm gonna reroll. That was a bad idea because now we can't do anything about that. That's okay. Let's uh, let's get some purge. No, let's go to the let's go to the caverns first. We gotta be pogs. Give me some goodies. As you pass a train graveyard, you notice several of your fallen allies. Within the beasts of gnarled steel lie now extinguished pyre shards. By the way, I am available if you want me to narrate your game for you. I'll do it for a, a song here. Even further inside the rubble, you can make out some last protected treasures. Perhaps if you were to relight the pyre shards using some of your own, the trains would reveal their value. Which train pyre shards do we take? Lose three health, upgrade a unit. Lose six health. When your pirate uh, gets some restore, Heartless cannot be healed. Friendly units get plus 10 and Heartless. Honestly, that's dope. We don't do any healing. Plus 10 health for everybody? Dude, drinks all around. Who's opened the tab up? Oh, no, it's just the weird guy in the uh, the ice crystal caves. He knows his stuff, though. He's He's been around the, uh, he's been around the block a couple times. All right, now we get to actually make a difference here. Look at this. This is, this is disgusting. I feel bad. For the for the dudes. Ooh, this is actually kind of disgusting too. I kind of like the the train steward just as as fodder. So I'm just gonna remove some of these torches. Maybe it's maybe today is the day. Maybe we finally earn some respect for the train steward. Maybe it's like you know it's the moment after high school where like their acne goes away and then you realize you know what like as a human being. As a human being that you have taken advantage of. Hidden Assault. Uh, Non-boss enemy units get multi-strike for an artifact. I'll be real with you, I'm kind of scared. So, no. I just want to win. Simple Machines. It's okay, it's alright. That's not a, it's not a great... Uh, it's not as great as I assumed. So I actually have a great play here. You wouldn't have even believed. Uh, not a combat in... Who is this? Not a target in combat? I don't like that at all, actually. I'm gonna set this guy up here. So, we, got, we can't hit these guys for the first turn, so they'll, like, eat us alive, I guess. But then, as they come up here, we'll, we'll destroy them. And now, look at that. We got three energy back because we played two units in a turn. I'm using all my skills. My massive brain cells have just grown even larger. Um... Although I didn't realize that we could probably just murder them. I want to put this guy down here. How bad of an idea is that? Let's do it. What are you going to do to me? Seven damage? I eat seven damage for breakfast. On the days that I'm looking for a low-carb breakfast. Okay, we've got uh, death happening. Death and destruction. Sounds good. This guy's getting the sweep damage out, which is what you've always wanted. And we can't play this, but otherwise, these zero-cost uh, spells are going to destroy. I don't know, Porridge too hot, Porridge too cold. This Porridge seems just right to me. Amazing setup, by the way. Uh, what do we got? Another triple boy. He's taking 21 damage on the chin. Probably a better way to say that. Let's make that none. Very fair. We're gonna set up our uh, our juice boy up on the top. Why is he juice boy? 
He's the bodybuilder that, like, drinks Capri Suns all the time. It's a stereotype I've just now made up, but you will see it everywhere. Now that it's been said. It's the, uh, Bader-Meinhof phenomena, as Reddit would like to remind you. Sir. This guy's taking no damage. What the heck is happening? Am I just winning? I think I'm just winning. Uh, please, mouse. Obey me. Um. This guy, we're not encanting? Oh, that's not an encant one. It's this guy that encants. Dummy. No room. Maybe we should have gotten rid of him. Just stroke my scruff here for a second. I think there's zero problems. Uh, in fact, I think we've just completely destroyed uh, the encant guy is up here. So I'm going to do just check this out. This is a... Uh, excuse me. Can I not play the rest of these? I call nonsense on that. We could like... <laughs> we could spell our own guys just to get the extra, like the permanent buff there. But that seems stupid, right? Mama didn't raise no dummy. Dude! The Shaman of Sorrow. Uh, yes. Let's do ourselves a favor here. Is he stealthed up? No. He just sweeps. Two ninety-eight. Hell yeah, brother. All right, so two ninety is. It's a shame that we have to lose these fine fellows, but this is a great game to stream. It's like dinner and a show if you're kicking back. And then for me, it's like I can just let the events happen, and it's basically entertaining. I got you know I'm doing my best on the other end of it. Let's get our, let's get our boy some shield here. Zero reason not to do that, and the train steward, unfortunately, is useless, just like the rest of his, uh, poor life. Yeah! Oh, I didn't even notice! We killed him! Touchdown? Other such sports metaphors? Goal? Uh, I don't know. There's more sports besides those. Apply silence to units. Disables triggered abilities. Seems nice. Apply spell weakness. Also seems nice. Uh, and another consume. These are all consume, actually. I haven't played with that silence a lot, but I assume it would be very helpful. Um, this here... Cannot be healed. That's fine. Sacrifice imp for some extra goodies. Let's take that. Please, sir, don't, don't ice me for paltry benefits. All right, your, your purpose here on this earth is up to me, the god of this realm, to decide. So you kind of made a huge mistake coming here. We can duplicate another card. That's ridiculous. Or we can start removing more cards. There's no shop over here either, huh? Uh, ah, okay, let's, let's go this side. I, I like the duplication, but... We got all this money. We're not going to spend it, you know? Large stone. This is ridiculous. Level 3, cold Chalia. Level 2, level 2. Level 3, level 3. I, I just... Don't even think about it. Just grab one of these guys and, and set them on their way. Dude, with the, with the sweep, this guy will... Excuse me. This is why I will destroy things in his path. Um, rage is just ridiculous. Also on the sweep character. It's just... It's just the way it's gotta be. Um... And we can set up this other uh, unit to be real good from the start, too. It's like, you can't lose! Endless? How? What are we going to do to be endless? We're, we're going to make this guy endless? Because then we can just sacrifice him and keep bringing him back to keep getting our spells back from the abyss? Thereby hard countering the boss? Thereby expanding our brain to the size of the freaking moon? Yeah, it sounds good to me. 
That sounds great to me, my friend. Let's just make a an absolute unit happen there. And uh, we've now spent all of our money, which means it's been a good day. We're gonna say goodbye to the last two like useless cards in our deck. Sorry, she knew it was gonna happen, brother. And that's it. We're ready. Considering the time, you would uh, expect this to be the final boss, but I think we've got one more after this. Didn't even pay attention to the stats. It's not about that anymore, okay? It's not about numbers and stats. It's not about these numerical possibilities, okay? It's about domination. Spell shield. I don't like it. Multi-strike. I don't like it. And then these guys, when they die, they get plus two damage to everybody. Okay. Okay. But did you consider... Wait a second. First of all, sweep character on the bottom. And then... Should we even do that? Because they're just going to die. I guess we can get it on... We can start adding that up on there. And then this is, this is not going to go through the wall. Spell shield 5. Yeah. We're going to have to just damage this guy to death. Which is cool with me. I don't like that sound effect. Stop using it. I'm not into that at all. Our demon fiend is ready? Oh, that's all you had to say. Uh, is anybody dying down here? Nope. In that case. Welcome to your doom. Uh, we can apply silence. Sure. Because it silences the boss. I don't think multi-strike is a triggered ability, honestly. But I guess the uh, the other DPS stuff is. There is no imp to sacrifice, right? Yeah, so that doesn't work. Um, might as well armor our, our sort of tank up. Uh, and then this is going to do nothing. So we are done. Take your beatings, my friend. Just take it. Don't like these sound effects, dude. They're very borderline on what they're implying, okay? Very borderline. I'm just saying for the kids out there watching this series. Uh, Siren of the Sea, Heartless. Yes, okay. We will put that guy in the back. Everybody's feeling fine. Uh, we have an Impish Scholar that we can use to bring back something from Consume. Uh, what is what is even happening right now? I guess we can just like, I'm not really worried about the units to be honest. I think we can just kind of kill those guys. This guy is chunky, as a chunky monkey. We've now brought back a horn break just to destroy this guy's whole career. I'm gonna ruin that man's whole career. This guy is a master, a master train hopper. But what they don't tell you is that Joe the Plumber is coming to ruin your life. Goodbye. Oh, the spell weakness. Forgot about that. Um, that's not gonna help at all. Where's our encanter? This guy's the encant. This guy's taking a lot of damage. Here at Mechawill LLC, we take care of our own, okay? We have an employee in trouble. We're going to take care of him. We'll pay for, you know, a small portion of their health insurance. It's, it's the most we can do. It's the most we can do. This guy's got a, a, a bag on his head, which is hilarious. I like the visual element going on there. We also just have zero cost cards happening right now. How fantastic. Um, and I feel bad for everybody involved, basically. Let's just, let's tank up this guy. This is our first line of defense they never tell you about. Um, please die. So, I like the frostbite on the boss, because it's just gonna slowly, it's gonna slowly scoop them down so you get to the end of the Honey Nut Cheerios. And then all that's left is to drink the milk, my dude. Yeah. 
It's Fruit Ninja. Amazing sound effects. Okay, 84 damage for free. Sounds fantastic. Uh, this guy wants trouble. He's asking for it. It's just the it's the way he's dressed. I'm sorry. Uh, this will not happen here. We've got no room. So yes, we will do this. And then immediately destroy him. It's, it's genocide, is what you're telling me? But, uh... You know, see if I care with the amount of spells that we have. Let's just try and kill... Mm, try and kill this guy. Is that gonna work? No. Okay, now he's dead. Finally! We're gonna send him back to the Shadow Realm. What is the Shadow Realm? Well... It's a place for, uh, you know, bad video game characters. It's as simple as that. Uh, Demon Fiend is ready. Bone Saw is ready. Don't mind if I already did. Let's set that sucker up. This man will wish that he had never been born. The other guy, not my guy. My guy is very happy in his birth, okay? Spike of the Stygian. Spike of your mom! Sorry, it's a little 2005 crept up in me, okay? Sap and frostbite. Wait a second, you're not doing any damage. Understood. It's that simple. You can murder somebody with a single punch. Bruce Lee proved it, okay? The one-inch punch. Okay, let's, let's get iced up here. We can do some more damage to the boss. Honestly, some, some Halexical Crystals sound fantastic. Flash Freeze, dude. We're going to keep your uh, your perishables in great shape. Say goodbye. And uh, 141. Oh, I forgot about this guy, but who cares? Everybody forgets about that guy. <laughs> it's sad. It's too much to comprehend. It's too much to handle there. Hello, Mr. Bagman. I can see you're taking a little bit more damage. I, I'd really appreciate if you decided to just die. That would help me out a great deal. So I'm going to do something you, you're never going to see coming, okay? Oh! Can't summon it. We need more space. That's not a good thing. Well, I tell you what. He never expected the, the Sap Frostbite. 475 combo. It's like an Atari video game. They've got one sound bite. They just... They keep playing to save on memory. Alright, the final... Excuse me, my scroll wheel. Please function. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Let's give him one of these bad boys. Wait a second. Yeah, we can't do our imp play, unfortunately. I mean, he's dead. I wasn't even paying attention. He's dead. got cremated, my man. All right, we're spilling a little bit into the Sekiro time. I gotta tell you, I really want to finish this run. Maybe we can try and just, uh, you know, speed it up a little bit. Consume this card is interesting. Transfer Frostbite. Let's, oh, why not? We'll try that out. And then capacity, we're dying on capacity. So let's get that extra one. That'll help us do our imp plays. Basically murder for, uh, you know, a few a few paltry goods, but I'm, I'm up for it. And uh, let's, let's, let's get some more. Let's get some more bad boy spells here. Double stack. Let's get a double stack. Absolutely, that could be huge. We got 65 left. Okay. These are our only our only things we can use here. 35 twice. I'll take it. You hit him up with the old double double, dude. It's the secret uh, it's the secret menu item they don't tell you about. And then let's do uh this this is very expensive, so please, sir. 
That is the final boss. Okay, boys. We're we're in it. Uh Is there anything we want to remove here? To be honest, these lances kind of suck, okay? It it hurts when you say it straight to their face, but you know, now they know. Let's get one last upgrade. We'll do our final battle and then we'll be switching to to Sekiro in just a second here. Uh handheld totem. Uh it's Factotor. And uh, let's see damage spells cost less. Apply spell weakness. Damage spells cost less. But he's got better stats. Let's do uh let's do spell weakness. Take us, my friends. Take us there. Additional coins, but everybody gets a crap ton of damage. Let's do it. Why not? Because we're here and also we're we're over time, so what are you gonna do to me? That hasn't already been done, okay? What are you gonna do to me when my segment runs too long? Because, you know, I haven't played much of this game. 13 damage? Uh, I've made a huge mistake. Okay. I like it. Now there's only 29 damage on the floor. Oh, this guy's pretty good, though. Yeah, let's, let's set up. There you go. Give you a little extra armor. It's not ideal, but we did take the big challenge. We're not here to play around. We're not here to play games, okay? This is this is deadly serious. This is life or death to me. This guy is dying, and I don't like it. Um, but I really want this guy out, though. It's a lot of plays here. Now, how much damage... Dude, I'm losing my mind. He might die. It's a bad idea. I mean, we could have gotten these guys out, but... I didn't even do the math. Sacrifice him. All right, well, say goodbye, Cold Chaley. We, we missed you. That stings. That stings a lot. But we, our pyre has never been touched by human hands. Um, so we might be okay. Yes. Seventy damage. What is wrong with you? Let's save a little bit of that. We can't afford the Impish Scholar. Uh, so, there you go. Problem solved. Oh, I didn't even notice. Okay, we're, we're doing all right. I'm, I'm, this is, this is grueling. We might die here. We have to be very careful. Uh, these guys are dying. That's not okay. Why is this guy getting buffed so much? When a unit dies, they get 15 armor? Are you outside of your mind? Um... We gotta, we gotta take these boys out in the back there. Did I do that correctly? Yes, I doubled it, but he's still dying. We made a terrible mistake, my friends. They're too good. Forgot about that too. <laughs> Our world is crumbling and falling apart around us. They're dead. The boss isn't even here. That's the real. That's the real conundrum. 18 damage. Okay. Goodbye. Goodbye. And now we're living. He's not though. We can do. Uh, does 18 damage? I don't think we can save you, brother. I think our big boy is dead. This guy, we're just gonna let do whatever he wants. And, uh, yeah. This can't, it can't function like this. It can't be the only way we get to the second game in our, uh, <laughs> in our lineup here is if we lose on the second to last floor. That can't be the way this works. That's not a good payoff. Don't you ever see TV shows? Okay. We have a play. Four damage. I can do four damage. This guy's dazed or something. Send him to the Shadow Realm. Send him to the Shadow Realm. We don't really want to consume anything, huh? 
I'm gonna save those. Mr. Cheesenip is back in the house. It's good to see your friendly face again, my friend. We're just about ready to switch to our second game after we either die or make the greatest uh, comeback in history. Okay, so this is the boss. Let's silence him. So that way he cannot trigger his revenge. Now he's now he's not such a big cat, is he? A big fat cat. Uh, he doesn't sweep, so we should put armor up on the top. He's now taking five hundo. They don't tell you about that in school. Let's give him this. Five forty-nine with one unit left. I think we're in trouble, boys. Oh, but he's got spell weakness now, so we, we might be able to just explode him. Look at this. Stack it up, my friend. Enjoy the show, I guess. What's going on with you today, Mr. Cheesnip? How you feeling? I haven't seen you on a stream in a while. Okay. Step one. Step two. Step three. Step four. Step five. Oh, we're getting him out. Uh, double his frostbite. Step six. Step seven. 331 with one floor left. We might just make it. Playing some Fallout 76 with a friend. So you purchased the game. Like you said you would in my chat. And now... To fulfill your contract, you must tell me how it is, because that's what we agreed upon. Don't you remember? No more spell weakness. Yeah, this is not good. Uh, ugh. I guess... Let's get a consume spell back. 26 damage. It's not good. This is not good, brother. We're not gonna play this Frozen Lance. That's the one card that we will not play. Uh, okay. It's it's up to the, the hands of fate now, boys. Let's see if Bagman can... Whoa, we got him! We sent him away! And we got four hundo for it, dude. We're rich. We're rolling in that stuff. Frenzied Swarm. Apply Dazed. But discard your hand. That seems pretty good. One damage to a random enemy unit five times, or more Frostbite consumed. More frostbite consume, please. Uh, yeah. Sacrifice imp. I like it. It's bait. I told you it's imp genocide, and I am not apologizing for it. All right, all right. We got one floor left. Just bear with me here, okay? One floor left, boys. We can do a duplicate card. We can do some more spell work. The merchant is is for everybody. Or we can remove more cards. Uh, we don't need to remove any more cards. Okay, we got 550 to spend, and we might as well spend all of it. So permafrost. Wait a second here. Permafrost means we like hold on to the card when we're ready. So this is a good one for permafrost, because like we can just when it's at its maximum potential. We'll be good to go, you know. This one is less incredible. But, uh, yeah. I mean, it's all, it's all gravy. We're not going to complain about it. We'll do the Sacrifice Imp for free. 350 damage sounds pretty good to me. Let's re-roll. Let's get double stack. We're about to pog up. We, we, can, we can apply 10 armor. Or double Frostbite sounds good to me, but double Frostbite on all units. Yes, yes. Alongside... Uh, we don't need to put all our eggs in one basket there, here. Uh, an incredible flash freeze. And finally, a, uh, free Titan's gratitude. I hope that the Titan is grateful that I have done that for him. That's the type of, of gratitude I want to see in this world. We want to remove anything. Honestly, no. Sorry, brother. We made our bed. We will now line it. I also forgot there's a trinket shop. We could have gotten way more than we just did. 
Uh, enemies get minus one. That seems kind of nice. Consume cards have a 50% chance to be discarded instead. That was made for us. Oops. I didn't collect all my rewards. Oh, I get a duplicate. Dude, we could duplicate Cold Chalia. Nobody would question it, would they? Nobody would question it. Our frostbite is out of control. Let's do the final boss, final round. Pog yourselves up, boys. We are ready to enter into the ring with Muhammad Ali. Also known as Seraph the Diligent. It's a lesser known stage name, okay? He's got power drain, which means he consumes crap, but we got a, a trinket here that says, think again, brother. All right, it's very, very simple. They're not doing that much, so I'm just gonna set up this bad boy. Set up this bad boy. And, uh, what can we do to save some... This guy already consumes. Now this does not consume. But the boss is going to take some extra damage. And, uh, might as well get this guy's health down as much as we can. It's all going to work out. You need to believe that we're going to succeed. Hashtag believe succeed. Get ready. I mean, these guys stand no chance. These are actually, like, puny mortals. Um, this guy being all the way up here is a little annoying. Not gonna lie. Uh, but yeah, sure. We'll, we'll consume a frozen lance. See if I care. We're gonna set up our... Oh, this is the guy that, like, gets pogged up, right? We're gonna set up our pog man up here. Uh, this normally consumes, so there's no reason to not. Although... Yeah, I, I like the idea of just stacking it on the boss. And it got preserved! Fantastic. I'm gonna keep this guy along for uh, alive for a little longer. And I'm just gonna... We're just gonna, yeah, kill the boss before it even steps to us. You know what I'm saying? Don't start nothing, won't be nothing. The little bugs fly away. Alright, our cold chalians are ready. That's what I love to see. Okay, let's make this very simple here. We're gonna give this guy a little extra armor. Eight and ten. What kind of joke is that? Double cold jelly of floor they never tell you about in school? <laughs> Probably because it's a bad idea, but you know what? Ooh, let's take like a hundred damage off the boss. Does that sound nice to you guys? Is anybody dying? No? It's, it's what we call gravy, brother. Send them back to the depths. Whoa, somebody got up to there to the pyre. Didn't even notice. That's how unconcerned I am right now. This guy, 2085. Zero problems. Nobody's dying. That means we've got all the time in the world to set up. Um, I don't even know what to do here. Like, this guy will get pogged up in a sec. Don't you worry about that, okay? Don't you freaking worry. Um, and yes, we will consume and just add some some absolute damage to this guy. He's taking 36, and I don't like it. Let's let's stop that from happening. He's taking 26 now. That'll do. That'll do, little pig. If you guys are enjoying the Monster Train series, voice your support. It helps me know, you know, what segments to keep, what segments to lose, as well. What the heck? Uh, as uh, on YouTube, if you like it, the thumbs up helps my videos do better. So. If you like it, there you go. Uh, we got silence. This guy doesn't have any trigger ability, huh? He's just got multi strike, huh? Uh huh. Yeah, it sounds sounds about right. This is a this is a trigger. So that seems like a waste, but what else are we gonna use it on? You know, a double stack, a frostbite. This is what they don't tell you about in school. You ready? 38 stackable damage. Tropical poppables. Some vengeful shards is not even going to cause us a problem. Don't even worry about it. Now, who's living up here? Nobody's living. How about these guys? These guys are living. But we're going to stick to the game plan. Get rid of those pieces of garbage. You guys are about to see world domination happen. From a mere train car. <laughs> Who's dying? Who's dying? Nobody's dying. Oh, he's dying. Okay, so we have some actual work to do. We have no imps. Oh, wait. Yes, we do. 
So we could sacrifice or we could explode the imp. To be the big man, get some extra energy. We didn't need the energy, honestly, but we'll take the, uh, take the 25 damage, I guess, over the 50 damage. Whoops. Uh, these guys need to go. So let's do this. And problem solved. I did not do the math on that. Uh, we can't play this one, so that's fine. So we're just going to kill him. Get this guy close to death. And uh, kill this guy again so we take less damage. We're a god. Nothing can stop us. We're Bill Murray in Groundhog's Day, dude. We've seen the outcomes. Like the Matrix running through our cranium. This guy only had seven health left. That was a mistake. Should have been paying attention to that. <laughs> uh, but this guy is doing all right. Getting good grades. These guys are okay. Nobody's making it to the top floor yet. Transfer all Frostbite on this floor to a unit and then double the amount of... Fr That's ridiculous. Uh, 50 damage, we could double it on the boss in just a quick sec, which we may or may not do. But let's let's get the uh, the imp up here. That's a bad idea. We probably should have put that on somebody. There's no way that guy's surviving. Just gonna let you know. No, we'll we'll discard that card at random. Look at that, 126 damage. He's not even out of a grade school yet. Uh, okay, he's still dying. I'm sorry. Let's say our say our prayers. Say goodbye. Oh, yoked one. You paid a terrible price indeed, but it's the final battle. And you stand no chance. This guy's dead. You don't have to worry about him. He's only taking three damage. What a joke. Let's, let's just keep him preserved right now. Um, six frostbite. We're just gonna stack up the frostbite. Uh, and maybe we should have put this down here first. We don't have room anywhere else, do we? No, okay, so. Yeah, should have done that first. Gonna be real with you on that. But he's taking 265. I'm feeling good about this. We're in the final throws, okay? We'll have to play a shorter segment of Sekiro, but like I said, I don't think anybody's complaining about that today. <laughs> yeah. If you need some choir uh, voices, I'll do it for you. Right, we have, oh, we do have a scholar. Impish scholar. Gives us a, a hard choice again. That's fun. Impish scholar. Impressive. Wait a second. Yeah, hold up here. We're just gonna make sure this guy dies so he doesn't get to our pyre, just in case we have a problem. Okay, let it play out, boys. The battle is happening. Basically, the game knows if we've won or lost already. It's just too much of a coward to tell us. Another impish scholar. This is the main, like, deterrent to this guy. This is going to be close. He's got a lot of HP left. And we don't have a ton there. Wow. The BM. I spent an extra 20 minutes on this game. You must... I must win. Whoa, we got him! We got him! Send him home! I always believed. That last couple of seconds there, just forget about that. Take that outside of your memory, okay? And just like that, we've won! Another bit of monster uh, monster train. Hello, sidechain recording. Welcome back into the chat. Good to see the bodies here. Today, uh, Mr. Cheesenip, Minty Pup, Ghost Raiden. We've had a few poppins. I hope you guys are starting to enjoy this. We're gonna switch games. In just a second here, let's let's get this hell yeah going on.
Whoa, golden cards. By winning a run with these cards, you unlock their golden card frames. Sounds fantastic to me. Hell yeah. It's just that easy. Stygian Guard leveled up. Ice and Pyre. Very funny, George R.R. Martin. Sigil Seaweed. Cool. That guy does everything except work on his novels. Hellhorn, level four. Oh, ally of the alloy of the ancients. Too much stuff on the screen. The, the music in this game is up is up and down. Sometimes it it uh, it's great. God King Papa is online. That's funny. And um, sometimes it's it's just okay. All right, boys. So uh, we're gonna take a, a a very small break so I can switch the games. Um, and uh, we're gonna be back in about a minute uh, or two. So don't go anywhere. You can just stick around, enjoy. The entertainment. Maybe I'll put on some audio for you. Um, and uh, yeah, and I'll see you guys in just a second here. If you're watching this on YouTube, thank you for watching the Monster Train series. Uh, it's been a blast. Let's recenter here because, again, I still need to buy a webcam. Um, it's been a real blast. And uh, if you want the, the YouTube link at the description, I have all my Monster Train episodes up there so you can see them if you want more Monster Train here on Twitch or on YouTube. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys in just a second and uh, mostly set up, honestly. I just need to uh, start things, things going on, so enjoy.